Ukrainian forces defeat Russia's armored fist near Lyman. Over the past two months, in the Lyman direction, the Russian occupiers have become more active and attacked Ukrainian positions with a large amount of manpower and equipment. Despite this, the Ukrainian military managed to repel the attacks and inflicted significant losses in the equipment to the enemy. This was announced by the head of the Public Relations Service of the 21st Separate Mechanized Brigade, Serhii Dibrov, on the Espresso TV channel. The enemy had an order to achieve some success before January the 1st, but they failed. Then, for several weeks, the Russians gathered new forces, manpower and equipment. Recently, the Russians launched a new attack, as they say, like the last time. This time, we felt the impact of a large number of armored vehicles. The enemy has attracted dozens of tanks, infantry fighting vehicles and armored personnel carriers, which are now burning out in front of our positions, Dibrov said. The results of the successful work of the Ukrainian defenders was the loss of Russian armored vehicles, which were left to burn on the battlefield. Dibrov emphasized the effectiveness of the actions of Ukrainian sappers, artillerymen and drone operators who worked to destroy enemy equipment. The enemy's armored fist has noticeably decreased. Dozens of vehicles remained on the battlefield, so the Russians are again intensifying attacks with manpower and the number of artillery and small arms attacks on our positions, he noted.